So back on the road after 13 years in Vegas, what's it, what's it like to be back? Uh, I, it's really easy because uh, I'm only doing one weekend every month. So, I mean, in Vegas, I was every single night. So this is great. Um, I, I like driving to work, but I don't like driving to work every night, you know. So, yeah, it's nice here. Uh, 13 years as a Vegas headliner. Uh, what The longest-running comedy magic show in the history of Las Vegas. That's not bad for what I do. <laughs> Stupid stuff like, like that. Or here, here's one for you. You ready, JT? <laughs> With a pencil. I don't need props. I can use anything. What do you think that, that draw is that keeps people coming in year after year for four, genera four decades? I'm almost. brilliant. <laughs> I, I really am. I mean, there's not... We get a lot of laughs during my show. If you count the laughs per minute, probably my show's got more laughs per minute than any other show. So that's probably why. And I use the volunteer from the audience every night, so that makes it different. You know, whoever I get up there, if he's going to be a jerk, I have to deal with that, and the crowd likes to come and see what I'm going to do with the, with the guy on stage. So we got a lot of re return business. I've got longevity. People come up to me now and they say, you know, I've been watching you since I was a little kid. That's what I'm getting now. So, uh, but we're re retiring this year. In January, we're done because of this. What's this, that? That is keeping my heart beating. Whoa. Yeah. I have a bad heart. And if it stops, this thing will actually jumpstart me, give me the old shock that I need to, to revive myself. And if anybody happens to be touching me going, are you okay? They will probably have their heart stopped of the electricity going through my body so it's kind of a good practical joke i start my heart and stop theirs and jokes on them so so that's that's the reason for the retirement yeah then. yeah i don't have uh, i don't have the health to continue doing it for much longer than a year i'd say uh, at the end of the year we'll see how i feel but uh the doctors told me uh in a year i won't be i uh, probably able to do my show anymore so if the medicine's not working so when you started comedy magic there were other comedy magicians but no one was doing what you were doing just yeah the you got to find the right combination of comedy and magic there's a lot of magicians doing comedy there's a lot of comedians doing real magic but there's only a few Penn and teller do it right i do it right harry anderson used to do it right from, from night court there's not a lot of them that can do the right blend i think street performing had a lot to do with that being out on the streets and and not having a crowd that's there to see you and having to keep them there, you know, that had a lot to do with it. And, and what you were doing was, was uh, and is still just, it's, you're doing what people want to see when they see a magician. When, when, when they see a guy shoot himself or stab himself, they want it to go wrong. And so Yeah, if you cut a girl in half, there's going to be blood. And, and a lot of magicians don't think that way, but I do. I think I started to do blood tricks. A lot of stuff involved blood, and that's why I think I got my reputation. People kept coming back. They wanted to see the gory stuff. And slowly, working in Vegas, I had to phase that stuff out. But uh, I still do a lot of freaky effects. Like if you watch this one, check this out. Hang on just a sec. Okay. Watch my arm. Tell me when you're ready. Let me get rid of this thing. Ready? Okay, let me put my heart down. Watch this. This is kind of freaky now. I'm going to move my hand. This is about as far as most people can go before their arm breaks. But I can go, keep going, I can keep going, keep going. All the way around like that, which is impossible to do. And then I can do stuff with my ear, like poke a hole in it like that, you see. <laughs> I've really kind of shied away from carrying a lot of props around because I can do stuff with my body now that, that I don't need to carry all that stuff. I only have two suitcases. I used to have it like carrot top. I used to have it like a truck, you know. So now you've sort of become your act. Yeah, I don't need I don't need the props to be funny anymore. I can just do stuff like that, you know. So it's easier. Uh, what are What are people going to get when they see you know this is your this is your last hurrah? It's your last chance yeah. to, to say goodbye to the fans. What What are the people going to see when they come out? Well, they're going to see a really really good show. I think the show's tighter now than it's ever been. We just did. Uh, Detroit was the first place that we played where I announced that I'm quitting. 
and we had an outpouring of fans come out there. It was unbelievable. People were crying, and, and you know, it's really emotional for, for so many people that uh, you don't think you've touched that many people. But man, oh man, people said, you know, when I was had cancer and I was sick, you, you pulled me through, and all kinds of really beautiful stuff, you know. Um, so I. It, it, the show, because of that energy that the audience feels that they're seeing the last final show, it's going to be special. You know, it's, a, it's a, the timing is good. I got new material. Uh, you know, I have one more hour special in me, which I might do. You know, be, as a farewell sit to say goodbye. But uh, yeah, this is it. You know. All right, let me hop in there real quick. All right, so I guess I'll be your your brave and trusted volunteer here. Okay. Well, first let's see if you're smart enough to be my brave and trusted volunteer. You okay. have to take the quiz. What's the quiz? All right, two questions. How many animals of each did Moses take on the ark? Two. None. It was Noah, not Moses. Oh. You got one more chance. Say the word silk five times. Silk, 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 silk. And what do cows drink? Milk. No, they drink water. They give milk. They drink oh, water. Oh, no. Uh, I don't know if I can do anything with you. I uh, did JT. not pass the test. All right, one more, one more chance. Spell pop. P-O-P. -P. Top. T-O-P. Mop. M-O-P. What do you do when you come to a green light? Go. Yeah, Jace, you're in, baby. You're in. One out of three ain't you bad. You see when I just slapped your hand, what yes. I did? Your watch. <laughs> Wait a minute. This is my watch. No, that's actually my watch. You're better than you thought. <laughs> yeah. You're able to see it. It's like, how did I do stuff. that? That was so cool. Yeah. <laughs> it just spit right on your shirt, man. I'm so, oh, I love that. Oh. Ooh, I love that. That's like heroin to a comedian. Not that I've ever done heroin. <clears throat> you okay? I'm good. You want, you want one more question to see if you can get out of this gracefully? Yeah, I've, I've done so poorly so far. You really have? Yeah. All right, here. I need it. to redeem, redeem myself. Here it is. You have a microphone, too? That's a better, better microphone than I have. What is, what is, oh, I was going to get you again. Yes! Ah! Not Success. bad. Not bad. Okay, here's your question. Ready? How do you pronounce the capital of Kentucky? Is it Louisville or Louisville? That's not the capital of Kentucky. And it's Frankfurt. He's doing yes. really well. You're getting the hang of it. You see, you're a whole new weapon now, I man. I got it now. You are an all new weapon. I've passed yeah. the amazing yeah, test. Yeah, you did. And uh, I, I could even, because of that, I'll t teach you how to do pencil up the nose. Okay. I don't do this for everybody. Watch. All right, it looks good, but what you're actually doing is doing this. You're sliding your fingers down oh, and then biting okay. it and coming back out like that. So try it. I mean, it's got to go straight down. You can do this. Okay. First time, you just on the edge of your nose. On the edge of my nose. Yeah, and you go up with your hand, right? And now bite it and come down your mouth and okay, bite it and go down. <sighs> oh, man. <laughs> you did it. You now, if you practice like a that, natural. if you practice it, you can go and on, there, and on your ear and on the uh, uh, down. You just got to keep it going straight up and down. People at home, Straight up and down. Don't let it go like this. It's uh, it's really actually one of the best tricks you can do. And this even, kids love that. <laughs> That's my tongue, by the way, Jason. JT. It's just so you don't go home oh, and good. hurt yourself. And just get all the way through there. Yeah. I just bit the same pencil as the amazing Jonathan. It was on my nose, kind of, too. That's what that is. Mm. Look, at the, <laughs> look at you. Ah, that. Oh, That's no! it. Yeah. I can't believe yeah. it. Yeah. He got me again. <laughs> I think you stole some of that material from my uncle. Yeah, I am everybody's uncle. That's what I am. <laughs> I am everybody's uncle with one stupid trick. I know all the dumb tricks, man. My, kid, my, my nieces and nephews, they love my show. My grandma, 90, not so much. She doesn't really get it now. But uh, yeah, come out this weekend and see the show for the very last time. And uh, uh, do it quick because I feel this thing beeping right now. <laughs> No, I'm, I'm kidding. I'm going to step over I'm this just way. Kidding. I'm just teasing. This is cool, though. This is modern technology. Feel my heart. You feel that? Right here? Right there? Yeah. Whoa. Yeah, yeah there it is. That's a pad. It goes over my heart. So if I, if I, I, my heart starts to act up and I feel kind of woozy, this thing will go pow and give me a jolt like they do on the, on the hot, where your whole body lifts off the table. Yeah. Hopefully I'll be unconscious when that happens. Right. Yeah. So that would be preferable. Yeah. Yeah. It hasn't happened yet, though. I think right now I'm pretty healthy. And it... oh, what if I died right now? You would have the last <laughs> last interview. That would be quite the yeah. trick. You'd go. He showed me how to do pencil up the nose. <laughs>
Um, that wouldn't have anything to do with all that magic powder. Uh, Ixnay on the outer pay. Ah, gotcha. Yeah, I, my theory's always been that drugs are not the answer. Uh, that drugs is the question, and the answer was yes. So uh, it's probably part of my problem. <laughs> I grew up in this. I was a product of the 70s when, you know, Robin Williams and everybody was doing them. And then old John Belushi had to go and die and ruin everything. So. Curse him. Yeah. You got white powder on you. What's that from? Oh, God. That, that would have been three. I wanted that one so bad. That's all right. I almost no, I don't want you. You can't give it to me like that. No, I don't want you it. Don't. Like, no. <laughs> I'm not a charity case. <laughs> Well, I could do this all night, but I know we have a show, so we yeah. gotta get going. All right. Man. Um, let me just do it. Let me just do a tease here. Real yeah, you quick. are a tease. You're a little tease. You call me a tease. You use a tease. Um, that plaid yeah. shirt. It's true. Rip rippling muscles. Is it affecting your eyesight too? <laughs> this condition of yours. Uh, so I'm just gonna go in three, two, one. On Street's Corner, how you can see an amazing comedian one last time. Three, two. One. On Street's Corner, an amazing comedian comes to San Antonio for a disappearing act. No, you're still here. Uh, <laughs> let's see, what else can we say? Uh, Go on, you win. You can do this. Uh, three. three. Well, I, want, I, want to, I want you to interact with me on this one. Oh, um, you're going to do the... Okay, I'll interact. You want to get your third? Yeah, what? Okay. I'll interact. Um, Three, two, one. <laughs> on Street's Corner, we hang out with the amazing Jonathan. I was told to interact. And interact a little. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think that's the one. Okay, good. Thank you so much, man. You're welcome. I did not expect that. Well, we're interacting. <laughs>